guys, Zach Mars here, and welcome back to Tank on Rumpa. So, in the last episode, um, what was, what did we do last episode? Um, I, okay, so I don't even remember what we did last episode. Oh no. Uh, well, in any case, uh, in the la well, in any case, what in the last episode, whatever the hell I recorded before this, um, I don't remember, but uh, I'm re-recording. Though I'm actually re-recording an episode because uh, the last episode that I recorded, um, that you guys didn't see. Uh, I had to wind up scrapping because it wind up being so because the recording wind up by being so un, so being unsynced and so messed up that uh, I couldn't use it. So I have to now reuse this, re-record this. And uh, props to Spike Chunsoft for doing what I want in a game, which is manual saving, so that I can when there's a recording that goes wrong, I can go back and re-record it. Thank you, Spike Chunsoft, for doing that. That needs to be. I don't know why. Why? 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 Most my most game developers just decide to stray away from that. But uh, in any case, we can outdo a thing. Um. So yeah, we can outdo a thing. Um. Uh, okay, but in any case, we're gonna go, we're gonna go leave the room, and, uh, I think I know what I want to do. Um, first things first, I figured out what the shop is. Um, I can, so I figured out what the, that's the laundry room, but I figured out where the, sh where's the shop, where the hell's the shop? Uh, that's, uh, I believe the shop was in here. And I know what I, who I want to talk to first. I know exactly who I want to talk to first. I'm gonna re-talk to everybody that I talked to before, so I know what I'm doing now. Um, ish. Presumably. Maybe. I have no idea. Probably not. But I figured out what money- what I figured out what the monocoins I've been finding. That's what they're called, I think. But, uh, I figured out what they- what they're for. They're for this little gachapon machine that's on the counter here. Which is kinda neat. Also, I love how it's his theme music. Um... Uh... Let's put 10 this time. Alright, got an item. I'm not even sure what this does. Uh, let's put another 10 in since I since I want to buy some more, more things. And I, I kind of need to complete this part of the game as well. Got an item. Alright. Let's just throw all our money in since all we have gifts for people. I mean, that's, that's literally the only thing they're useful for. Got an item. Lucky. Oh, I got another item! Alright. I guess that's a thing. Well, it's the only thing I could use those for, so... Should probably get going. Yeah. Probably shouldn't screw around with the, with the Mono Mono machine. Um, especially since uh, I don't really know what it does. Being perfect. Okay, so who do I want to talk to first? Um, I remember I wanted. I remember I wanted to talk to cheese. What is it? Chito, Chitose or whatever, whoever the hell their name is. Because I got their name confused in the last episode as well. That is the that's not or that is not something I that that is consistent with what I, with my behavior. That's been consistent with my behavior today. I've been very bad. It's just just very. Uh, map. She should be in the locker room, right? Should, uh, right here. Uh, where the hell is she? Right outside the locker room. There she is. Hi, I wanted to talk to you and I didn't get to talk to you. Oh, oh Mikado, I didn't realize you were there. Um, mm, should I try to cheer up Cheer Hero? Spend some time with Cheer Hero. Yeah, I could use a little change of scenery. You're right. Do you mind keeping me company for a while? Um, I have no problem with that. All right. Uh, no, because I didn't get to talk to her. Oh! Oh, I don't get to talk to her regardless. Oh, okay, so that's a test thing. So that's test something. Uh, okay, so I should have given her a gift. All right, never mind. I now know, I now know what happened. Okay, so apparently I can't talk with Chihiro or get her, or get a gift from her. Get a gift for her. That's interesting. All right, well, in any case, the next person I want to talk to is actually... Where the hell is she? Uh... There. 
Um, I actually want to talk to Sakura, since Sakura is the person I was, I'm actually the most interested to talk to this time around. I can almost feel the wind in my face. Hmm, should I talk to, spend some time with Sakura? She looks fun. I buy the most greedy approach you take toward growing stronger. Now I'd like to begin training you on my family secret technique. Sakura introduced me to her family secrets. I feel like I've gotten a lot stronger. Sakura and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give- I don't have a- really have a present. Uh, actually, maybe I have a present. I'm not entirely sure if doing this will, will still work regarding- What the hell? Why not? Give her a ration. You're giving this to me. I see. That's very nice of you. Does that mean she liked it? My post training break is almost relaxing- my most relaxing time of my day. The sensation of your muscles cooling down after heating up during a workout is the only true reward. No matter how many times I experience it, I never get tired of it. Does, do you exercise every morning, Sakura? Unless there are errands that I absolutely can't get out of, yes, I always do my training. If I don't, I feel restless for the rest of the day. But I'm amazed you can do it every single day. Doesn't it get tough? I can't say I've ever seen it as tough. It's also that I can get stronger after all. And I have to keep on getting stronger because my destiny is to fight. Your destiny is to fight? From the day I was born, I've been fighting. Heaven sent me to live as its champion. That's one heck of a legend. My father was my master, and every waking moment was spent was spent learning to fu him to fight him. As a as a child, I sparred with boxing champions hit, and hit the mat with wrestling gold medalists. I was no match for them when we first began, of course. But, if, but before long, they they were no match for me. You mean you actually started being people like that? I'd say my specially slow stand-up that transitions into grappling in a strong ground game. Essentially, it's a complete it's a complete approach. Anything else just wouldn't make sense. You can only become the best by reaching the top of every discipline and fusing them all together. Stand-up fighting, grappling, and a strong ground game, that sounds like mixed martial arts. So, yeah, mixed martial arts is the correct answer here. You're basically a mixed martial arts fighter, right? And also, I should mention this since I know what it is. Um, Aikido is a, is a martial arts that, ironically enough, have not have nothing to do with actually fighting. It's, it, it's a, it is a martial arts that is entirely defense-based and is designed to disarm the opponent and defeat them without hurting them. It is, and it is not a very highly regarded martial arts in that regard because uh, obviously there's much better martial arts that are better at, that are better at self-defense. That one is literally just like, hey, I'm gonna drop you to the ground. There's nothing you can do about it, and uh, it's not the best. It's not the best martial arts in the world, but uh, it is, a, it is a fun martial art regardless. But uh, yeah, yeah, it's just a, it, I don't think it has the, I don't think it has the same respect as something as a kung fu or boxing or whatever, or whatever the hell. Taekwondo in my case, I learned Taekwondo when I was a kid. And I still, and apparently I still remember most of the moves because I, I was, I practiced them a whole bunch. But, uh, yeah, so long story short, it's not the most highly respected martial art out there because it's, uh, not as cool, basically. But, uh, that's right. It's the most, cool. it's the most effective real world fighting style, which is why I chose it. I don't want to be the world's be the best, in just the best in competitions. I want to be the strongest human on earth. I wouldn't bet against you, that's for sure. But aren't you already the best? No, not yet. There's still someone I have to surpass. Really? Until I can beat him, I'll never become the strongest. You mean there's someone out there stronger than you? Maybe I'll tell you about it another time if the opportunity presents itself. Sakura didn't make, make a sound as she left. I honestly can't believe there's someone out there stronger than Sakura. Even if they're real, can they really be human? Sakura's report has been updated based on your experience with her. I have gained more skill points, which is what I'm going to need to actually... Well, I head back to my room for. I'm going to need that to gain more abilities. So when I when I eventually have to do my next class trial, so uh, those are helpful actually. Ding dong, bing bong. And now Monokuma is going to show up and be a weird little prick because that's what Monokuma is. Hmm. <clears throat> this is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. As such, it is officially night time. Right. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked, and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. All right. Okay then. Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bug bite. I don't think my my thing's recording. Uh no.
Um, I think we're good. Seems like we're good. Seems like it just glitched up for a minute. Yeah, it's now frozen. All right. Seems like it's okay. I'm hoping it's okay. But even today, though today is over, I'm hitting my thing. Okay. This game definitely isn't. How long is this going to keep going on? All right. All the stress and anxiety kept me from falling asleep until late in the night. All right, and then ding dong, bing bong. Monokuma Theater! Whenever I spot a cute girl, I have a tendency to stare. I can't help it, it's just gaze with intensity. The other day, I rode my bike to the train station. I was in the bathroom, just looking at myself in the mirror. I am... I have no idea what he's talking about there. Being perfectly honest, I have no idea what he was talking about. But in any case, ding dong, bing bong. All right, Monokuma, what you got to say to me, you weird little prick? Good morning, everyone. It is now 7 a.m. and nighttime is officially over. Time to rise and okay. shine. Get ready to greet another beautiful day. I, I, I don't want to. I guess I better head to the dining hall before anything else. Uh, yes, time to progress the story. Uh, so who's in the dining hall? I want the breakfast meeting same as always, but. Is this everyone? Feels a little small. Byak Byakua and Toka stormed off yesterday, and it wasn't too surprising they had come today. Even the table looks bigger somehow. I assume it's because there's three people up three people are dead and two are abstaining. Yeah, with five people missing, I guess it would feel kinda empty. Still, I know Byakua is whatever, but shouldn't we go check on Toko? I vote no, she's super Serious. annoying. How can you be so cold? You're like a piece of rock candy. What? No, rock candy isn't cold, it's sweet! Anyway, Byakko is the real problem. Shit. If we don't keep an eye on him, he might really kill someone. You can see it in his eyes. We got no choice. Get some rope, we're gonna have to keep him bound and gagged. I think that's going a little overboard. He's right, in this situation, there's nothing scarier than when an ally turns loose cannon. It's just like when we were kids and someone would go crazy at sports during sports day or whatever. What the fuck are you talking about? You gotta use a rope to do tug of war on someone? Idiot. I'm not an idiot. You're an idiot. Yo! Who are you calling stupid? Damn you! Uh oh. Huh? What's wrong, Jiro? You don't look so great. Uh, I'm just going through a little self-loathing. Huh? Self-loathing. Well, after what Bianca said to me yesterday, I just got so nervous I locked up. I couldn't say anything. That's right. She yelled at him last. She yelled at her last time. Well, somebody. I ended up having to help me out, and even he said it was some someone who can't fight back. I hate how weak I am. Ah, I see. So Mondo made you depressed. What? How is it my Why? fault? Why? I wasn't trying to be mean. Besides, hey, girls are just on. naturally weak anyway, right? That's true, but you shouldn't say it. So, yeah. I should mention. Girls are... F physically, yes. Girls are weaker than guys. Physically. Physically. Like, like in terms of in terms of raw muscle mass, guys are a lot stronger. But, uh... That doesn't mean girls by any, by any means of the... Of the internet, by any means are weak. Um... They can be just as strong as a man if they want to be. Um, Sakura's a perfect example because she's literally is a man with a, is a man in everything but name. But uh, yeah, I mean, she, I mean, she isn't the, she is the, she is a very handsome woman. If we're if we're gonna put that in the light nicely, I'm not I'm, I'm digging myself a deeper hole here. But uh, the point is, women can be strong. Women can be just as strong as men, and uh, it's not really it's not really it, it not, it's not really just a matter of. Hey, being physical. Hey, it's just, it's not just a matter of hey, you're born, you get what you're born with. It's like you can work out and become as strong as you want to be. That's the thing. Get, uh, are you crying? It's because you were screaming like a lunatic. Hey, Don't cry. On. It's my fault. Okay, I won't yell at you anymore. Really? Not sure I can believe that. Just shut up. Huh? I, I, I'll make you a promise as a man. What? 
Promise as a man? Maybe I mentioned yeah, this before, but right. ever since I was a kid, there was only one thing my brother told me to do over and over again. He said that no matter what, a real man always keeps his promises. That's why he left me. He left you? Um, oh, yeah. My brother's yeah. dead. Oh, I see. Anyway, I don't want to talk That's about true. it. I don't want to make you guys, all you guys cry. Anyway, you can trust Yo. me when I make that promise. You don't gotta cry anymore. Okay. Thank you, Thank Hondo. You. So, sure. They're so cute. But I still don't like how I am right now. I have to get stronger. If I'm so weak, I can't... If, if, if I'm so weak, anything can make me cry. That's not good. Still, so, don't stress out too much about having to get stronger. No, I want to get stronger. Maybe I should start working out. In that case, I would be happy to help you anytime. But, but Miss Fujisaki will get smashed into a billion pieces! Shut up, you! Just a second! <laughs> <laughs> oh, finally cracked a smile, huh? Yeah. I see. Everyone, thank you. thank you. Looks like Chihiro's got some life back. Yeah, man, if we keep helping each other out like this, we're bound to get out of this crappy place sooner or later. I mean, someday, I'm sure. Yeah, it's, we've been in here a week, though. So, our biggest concern right now is the other two who never showed up to breakfast. Why can't I do anything to try and understand those two better? Um, okay, so where should I do today? Alright, well, I know from past experience that I can't actually go and talk to Toko. So, my next best bet I actually want to go and talk to Sakura again, is, is what I'm going to do. Because uh, that's where I need where I need to go next. Um, uh, so where the hell is she in terms of maps? Uh, map. I believe she's in the laundry room this time. At this time of day, right? I believe she's in the laundry room. Uh, can I knock on her door? I guess I should press the doorbell. Ding dong. Leave me alone. You don't have to pay attention to me. Sure. Let's spend time with Toko. Just do whatever you want. Uh, I believe... Okay, so I can't talk to her. Something I grew a little closer today. Do I have a gift for Toko? Do I have one? I should have one somewhere in here. Not sure what I have, but I don't have a ration anymore. I have a lot of these grayed out, so I definitely need to keep an eye on them. Uh, let's give her this. Sorry, but I'm already engaged to master. So I can't go on a date with you. If you're okay with that, I don't think I don't mind if you think about me. Since I got some place with something I gave her makes me happy. She's just standing there. Does she want something? Or she's not saying anything. Maybe I should try to start a conversation. Um, Toko? What? You wanted to talk to me? Well, I, I can't stop you, so talk already. Okay, sure, but what should I say? So, what do you want to do, like to do in your spare time? Why do you want to know? I mean, you know, we're trapped here together, right? If we're going to be friends, it's nice to get to know each other. Huh? What did you just say? Uh, after all that part about being trapped, we're going to be what? Uh, friends? <laughs> what do you mean, friends? You think I'm stupid? You're trying to trick me. I've already been hurt, hurt once before. I'm not going to let it happen again. You've been hurt? What happened? C come on, you don't really anyway. need to care about me. You don't want, you want to know about me. Even even I know that. No, no that's not true. Fine, then sell me. What Tell you what. Heck? You know what they call me the ultimate writing prodigy, right? Yeah, sure. You won all kinds of literature prizes and stuff. Then tell me what I'm good at. Tell me what my genre specialty is. If you really want to convince me that you give a crap, you should at least know that. You get genre that, the, uh... Romance! It's romance, of course. You, you actually knew? Of course! Your big success was Soul Lingers the Ocean, right? Everyone says it's your masterpiece. That book was such a hit that the fisherman shot to the top of the hottest men pools, right? How did you know all that? There's no way you could care about me. I'm telling you, I do. I mean, we're friends, aren't we? I'm blind. Straightforward nature blinded me. Yeah. All right. Toko ran off screaming like a banshee. I'm not really sure. Does she hate me now? 
All right, well, I guess we know that now. Just unlock the skill vocabulary. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Yay. And once we are all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. Do I have more time for another... I don't think I do. Do I have another time for... There's still time left in the day. I don't feel like just sitting here. Maybe I'll go explore. Uh, well, I want to go talk to Sakura again because that is what I did last time. So we're going to do that. Um... So, how do we get to the map? Where, where is Sakura? Where is Sakura in this, in this current, current timeline of events? Oh, they're hanging out! That's cute! I didn't even notice that the last time I recorded this. Um, so it goes in her room. Dining hall. Alright. Alright, that's kind of cute that they're just hanging out. Oh, did you need something? Hmm, should I Let's spend some time with Sakura. I just got it done exercising. Now would be a good time for a break. Would you like to give something to drink or talk for a bit? Sakura and I sat down for tea in a calm, relaxing conversation. Um, Sakura and I glucose are day. Do I have a gift? I, I should have one more gift left, right? I have a ration in here somewhere, right? Yeah. I gave her the ration. Um, I believe that's the only thing I can give her. Rose in vitro. Golden. Where is that? What did I? F what did I just pass? Golden airplane. Sure. Give her a golden airplane. You're giving this to me. I see. That's very nice. Oh, does she? Okay. I suppose I don't mind talking with you a little more. Maybe can I ask you something? What is it? It's about what we were talking about before. You said there's someone out there stronger than you. Can I ask? Is it a guy or a girl? Is a man. Hmm. A man that Sakura has to surpass. Maybe she's talking about her own teacher, which would mean your dad. You were talking about your dad? The family dojo has been passed down from generation to generation for the past three centuries. Three centuries? That's one heck of a history. I was born into my family as an only daughter. Male or female, doesn't matter. It's my duty to protect our legacy. And because I am a woman, I must be even stronger if I were a man. Someone would say that a woman is incapable of becoming the strongest human alive. I want to prove them wrong. Which is why I subjected myself to such fever straining under my father's instruction. Surpassing my father was certainly important to me. But that was just a matter of time. What do you mean? I was 14 years old when I first beat my father in a sparring match. After that, I never lost my father again. Wait, then... Yes, I have already surpassed my father. I don't believe it. I'm not sure I did the right thing. My father, father also had the desire to become the strongest human alive. But I can't look back. I can only move forward and try to claim that title for myself. That is my destiny. Well, that was all for now. That was enjoyable. Goodbye. Alright. Without another word, Sakura left me standing there alone. Wait, hold on. I never did find out who could possibly be stronger than her. Did she avoid talking about it on purpose? Sakura's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. You also like the skill breathing technique. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. All right. After we were done, I decided to head back to my room for a while. And now we go get to, and now we're going to go to sleep because, uh, right? No, there's something, I'm remembering there's something else before this. Right. I better get something to eat before it's nighttime. Should head to the dining hall room then. Okay. Yeah, we only got a certain, yeah, we got to go find a snack. Uh... Alright, I just wanted to get something to eat. And now I'm about to get roped into something like this. Actually, no, I guess I'm already roped in. Hi! Hey, Makoto! Perfect timing! Huh? What's going on? I have a favor to ask. A favor? I have a bad feeling about this. What favor? Come on, Makoto, you gotta be our witness. What witness? A witness of what? This guy's been talking shit about me since day one, calling me a coward and shit like that. You are a coward! That's why you're tur turned to violence to solve your problems. That's why you can't do what society asks of you, why you walk around dressed like that. The fuck you said? You don't know shit. You've already lost yourself, but you're such a coward you don't even realize it. So what are you saying? So you're what? You're saying you're not a coward? You think you're tougher than me? 
I know I am. Okay, but let's throw down. Prove me you got what you got I don't. I accept your challenge. You hear me? So that's what ha what? what's happening, Makoto. You gotta be our witness. Are you gonna throw down? You're not gonna, like, start punching each other, are you? There's a bathhouse on the first hey. floor of the dorm, right? With a sign inside? I see! A simple dorms contest, is it? We're going to see who can stra stay in the sauna the longest, am I right? Goddamn straight! Piece of shit. Okay. I remember this. This gets a little too intense for me. Uh, are you guys really gonna have to go through with this? Shit, yeah. Stop fucking around. He'll be done in a matter of minutes anyway. People like him are, without exception, I'll talk. Ring it on. You wanna on. go down? Hell, let's make things interesting. Wouldn't want to win without a challenge, right? Interesting. We're gonna battle with all you our clothes son on. Of a bitch. That's idiotic. Ridiculous. Suicidal. What? You afraid? You wanna fight? You're gonna regret this. Shut up and let's Stop do this. Fucking around. So yeah, this is where things get a little too intense. Hey, Mondo. What asshole? You can take off your uniform, you know. Go ahead. I won't judge. And you can shut the fuck up and mind your own business. I mean, look at you. Your face is all red. What are you, one of those goddamn hot spring monkeys? <sighs> it just so happens, I was born with mm. a red face. You don't have to act all this big, is, man. This is a terrible idea. Act, you say? <laughs> I'm still plenty good to go. I'm so good, I could eat a steaming hot bowl of soup right now. All right. This is... Are they? Okay. I tried to push my concern aside. A few minutes passed, then a few dozen minutes, then an hour. Don't you think it's about time you gave up? What about you? You can't even hardly talk. Dumbass. <laughs> Say whatever you want. I'm still totally good to go. In fact, I'm starting to feel uh, kind of cold. Yeah, that's that's. No, it is not. Good. Hey, uh, guys, I know you both want to prove how big a bass as you are, but uh, don't you think you've done enough? Shut up. Yeah, I just can't win. Ding dong, bing bong. Thank you, Monokuma. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked. And entry at that point is strictly... And now I've missed out on my snack. Idiots. Okay, then. Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bug fly. God damn it. I wanted a snack, and now I don't get a snack. Hey, did you hear that? It's nighttime. How about we call it a tie? In a true competition, there's no such thing mm. as a tie. You win, or you lose. That's the only thing that matters. Listen to you, you son of a bitch. Then bring it on. I'll, I'll push you right up to the gates of hell. That's not a good hell. thing either. The gates of hell, that's not a good place to push someone. This isn't good, guys. Yeah, you hear him? Better crawl on back to your room. I'll let you know how it went in the morning. Then you can start spreading my, my legends. Come tomorrow morning. You'll fall down in front of me. Down on your knees. I'll show you where to do it. Big talk for someone whose face is about to explode. Right back at ya. Okay, well, good night then. <laughs> and then he just leaves. I really hope those two don't go overdo it. But I'm sure. To the death? No, surely it wouldn't go that far. Yeah. This is this is where it gets a little intense. The concerns stay with me as I slowly succumb to sleep. Malakoma Theater! If fate does exist, does that mean your future is decided the moment you're born? 
If all your yesterdays pile up to create your tomorrow. Is your future as final as your past? I just don't know. That's why I'm still alive! Because I don't know! That's why I desperately cling to life! Yeah, Monokuma is Monokuma theaters never make any goddamn sense. I don't understand them. They're just these abstract things that he just kind of goes on and on about in the middle of, in the middle of each night. I don't fully understand. Good morning, everyone! It is now 7 a.m. and nighttime is officially over! Time to rise okay. and shine! Get ready to greet another beautiful All right. day! Thank you. Morning, huh? I hope Mondo and Taka survived. I'm worried about the two of them. I heard to the dining hall more quickly than usual. And when I entered... Bah! What are you talking about, bro? Kaha! <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? Yeah, they become best friends. What the? Hey, Makoto! Yo! Thank you so much for acting as our witness yesterday. Huh? Are they friends now? They've been like this all morning. They were all buddy buddy as soon as they walked in. It feels gross. Feels gross. Hell no. no. Feels great, more like. This almost feels like sec sexual harassment somehow. Forget her, bro. A girl like her just doesn't get a manly bond. Friendship between men is stronger than blood. A woman could never understand. What do you just say? What right. you just said, bro? That was cool shit. I choose to get a tattoo of it. No, bro. You mustn't. Your body is a temple given to you by your loving parents. So, uh, who won the contest? Who gives a shit? Piece of shit! Yeah, don't ask stupid questions. What matters is that we both took part in it together. That's completely different from what you were saying last night. Friendship between men seems very simplistic. Nothing like what I'm used to with girls. Yeah, for real. Alright, well, I guess that's a thing. I'll throw up breakfast that morning. The room was dominated by Mondo and Taka's overpowering brotherhood. All in all, it was a pretty unfortunate experience. Alright, and then... I believe I know what's next. So what should I do today? Bing bong! Huh? More who could that, that be? Wondering who I'd come to visit, I opened the door and somehow forced and, and, and somehow forced their way in. Hi! Toko, what's the matter? Why are you so surprised? Are they or am I really that annoying? Well, I already know I'm annoying, so I came here knowing that, so that makes it okay. No, you're not annoying. I just wonder what was going on. I have a favor to ask. I want you to go somewhere with me. Alright. And where is it where we want to go? Well... well, The library. Huh? Are you looking for a book or something? Why don't you just ask Piyakua? He spends all his time in the library anyway. Did I, did I say something wrong? You're not a bl bl blabbermouth, right? This has to be a secret. I honestly have no idea what you're talking about, but if you want me to be quiet, I'll be quiet. Now let's go to the library! Okay, you don't have to tell me twice, ma'am. Just why so pushy. Quiet. Be quiet when you go in. Don't let them see you. She actually was starting to get annoying, but I did what I did, what she said and gently crept in the library. There he is, still reading his book. Unsurprisingly, Biaka was there him by himself absorbed in a book. He's here. <laughs> He's really here. Okay, Makoto, go talk uh, to him. Why am I? Do you have why? Talk to him if you want to so bad. I can't. I don't want to interrupt him. That's kind of crazy. Hi. Hi. He seems to be really focused on that book and doesn't seem like the best time to talk to him. Hey, you. What are you doing back there? I, ha I hate even having to look at you. Ah, so you noticed me, huh? Of course. Now hurry up and leave. And take her with you. Hmm. Hey, um, Biakua? <laughs> Remember how you said don't be a woman who dominates weak men, be a woman dominated by strong men? I never said that. Hmm. Well, actually, I thought it just sounded like something you might say. <laughs> Get out. And go take a bath, you smell. 
Don't, don't make me say it again. Go now before your stench latches onto the entire room. Okay. What a dick. I mean, we've established that, but still, what a dick. He's really dug us into us there. Maybe he was in a bad mood. She seems super depressed. Did he really upset her that much? Biaka, to go that far. He must really be concerned about me. Yeah, this is where it gets a little bit weird. I'm recording this. Huh? He told me to take a bath and everything. He must really care about my well-being. That's not what that means at all. Hey, Makoto, what do you think? Think about what? You think Biakua and I would be, be good together? Um, well, no, I don't really know. That's true. There's no way to know. But the distance between us doesn't change our love. Because as soon as you realize your feelings, the love is born. That's how love works. I don't think that's how love works. Okay. There might come a day when you understand. Maybe. Someday. Well, bye. That was weird and creepy. Ah, uh, young love. Ah! Who would have ever guessed you would go for someone like him? But eager passion can also be scary. Sometimes that leads people off in the wrong direction. And he's gone. All of a sudden, I feel exhausted. Maybe I'll head back to my room for now. Huh. I, I hate that bear, man. Yeah, he does that all the goddamn time. It's annoying as hell. There's still some time left in the day. What to do? Free time! Uh, I got one opportunity to go talk about people about free time, so... Let's go. I didn't get to talk to somebody earlier. Hold on. Who do I... Who did I want to talk to? I forget who I talked to in this part of the in this part. Um. Uh, the only thing I can. Uh, I'm gonna talk to Sakura again because I kind of want to finish her story because I didn't get to do that last time, and uh, her story is interesting. Makoto, I. Hey. Actually, never mind. So, hmm. what do you want? I want to have. I want to be friends. Well, you know, Makoto, you seem a little thin for a man. How about I help you bulk up a bit? I guess that works. Alright, Sakura and I grew a little closer today. Would you like- I, do I have- do I even have a present for her? Do I even have a present for her? I don't think I have a present for her. I have a ration that I already spent on her. I don't think I have anything for her. I'll have to check, but I don't think I have anything for her. Uh, golden airplane. I believe golden airplane was the last thing I got. So, voice changing boat. To oh, this really is a bug to a detective at the body of a child, but the mind of a genius. The boat tie lets its user speak in a variety of voices. You didn't need to go through all this trouble for me. Does that mean you liked it? You know, Makoto. Hey, there's something that has been concerning me. What? The school has all kinds of exercise equipment, which is great. But it still doesn't offer everything I need to complete my training. I feel like I'm getting weaker by the day. Am I supposed to just accept that, accept my atrophy? I, I can't do it. If something doesn't change, I'll... I'll... It's okay, Sakura, just hang in there. I know how important you must feel, but you can't rush these things. But what you, what you say doesn't have everything you need to complete your training. What do you mean? Well, I can't say I'm a huge fan of modern training techniques, which rely mainly on machinery. That's good for building muscle mass, but it doesn't necessarily translate to actual strength. More muscle is better, of course, but you also need to know how to use it. And if you're not used to it, pushing your muscles too far can lead to injury. There's also even some weir some world-class wrestlers who only build muscle by climbing ropes and things like that. In mixed martial arts, speed, agility, and endurance are all necessary parts of a total body coordination. If that's your goal, you can't just focus on one aspect of your training. For example, keep it, keep it, skip it. Okay, they, they, they skipped a, they skipped a, speaking of which, they skipped a letter. Skipping pull-ups can, tra can train one area while power training, tra training equipment works multiple areas. Are you listening? Uh, oh yeah, ab yes, absolutely, got it. Weight-free training is an option, sure, but power training is a much greater challenge. I've had my own training methods ever since I was a little child. For example, I'd take an hey. old tire and hit it with everything I had. Are, are you still listening? Yeah, totally. So, what did I say? So what did I use to hit that tire I mentioned? What, are you sure you said it? 
The silence is deafening. I don't want to think about what Sakura might do if I don't answer. What should I... Uh... Your fists. You hear what your... You know, your fists. So you weren't listening. No, oh, I'm sorry. Did I say I prefer power training when exercising the entire body? No, I was listening. Something that you're using your entire body. Right. What she said to use... Uh... A hammer. I think I heard stories about people using giant hammers for training like that. Exactly so. I've been doing that ever since childhood. It's extremely good for your core. But that kind of thing is impossible here. And I can't, can't feel myself so growing weaker. I have to endure it. Enduring is the kind of thing that's putting power to being strong, isn't it? Hmm? Mm. I think. For now, I should focus on tra training my mind. Hmm. You've taught me something today, Makoto. The importance of endurance. Uh, well, I mean, I wouldn't call it that teaching, per se. Sorry for making you listen <laughs> to me complain. But I feel better now. I can handle this. I'm glad I talked to you. I'll find a way to repay the favor. Sakura left moving quickly for her size. So I guess I helped her? That's good. I'm glad to see she's starting to trust me a little more. Sakura's report card an update based on your experience with her. Your maximum number of skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go. And I believe three pages. I, I'm not entirely 100%, but I think there's only three pages per thing. All right, and now it's nighttime. Ding dong, bing bong. School announcements? I gotta go talk to somebody about school announcements? Ahem. A school announcement. Yes, school this is a, this is a, this is gonna continue the plot. I remember this. Nighttime is quickly approaching, but before it arrives, all students, please gather in the gym immediately. Emergency! Emergency! Yeah, he's got a thing for us. I remember this. Gather in the gym? Why not all of, why now all of a sudden? I really don't like the sound of this. I have a terrible feeling. As you should, because I know what's coming next. And I'm not a big fan of it either. Hi! I should really talk to you more. You're fun. Oh, Kyoko, did you hear the announcement just now? Indeed. Yes. I don't want to go, but I don't, don't. we don't have any other choice, right? I can't imagine it's going right. to be good news, but it's not a good idea to defy him here and now. So I'm going on ahead. Goodbye. Bye! I really can't do anything except what Monokuma tells me. Yeah, we're gonna go go talk to him. Uh, what about you? Can I talk to you? Hey man, you were hurt Yo. about to head in? Yeah, has everyone else already gone ahead? Looks that way. Dude, shit. I don't like it, but no, nothing's good gonna come out from ignoring that goddamn bear. Uh, Mondo? Aren't you sure you're okay? You look kinda went all out in that sauna. Well, what, who went all out? That shit doesn't even phase me. But you know, yo, there are the edge. Of, they're at the edge of hell. A promise between men was waiting was waiting for me. Never saw it coming. Anyway, let's get yo. our asses into the gym. Man, something unique must have happened between the two of them. Let's go find them. I believe the gym was this way, right? In the actual Hope Speak Academy, and not the dormitory hotel. What thing that we're gonna be going? It's got. It's around here somewhere. I remember. I, I forget specifically where, but it's around here somewhere. Um, uh, here. There's the guy. That's Homer Simpson would say. All right. All right, friend. I don't have time to stare at the display case. Okay, but I have just time to stare at, at, at Hifumi. Hey, Hifumi, how come you haven't gone in yet? Hiwawa? Mr. Daegi, don't Why scare me like that? that. Sorry, but we should really go inside. No, don't go. You can't go. <laughs> That's what my ghost friend is telling me. I don't feel good about it either, but we can't just ignore this. Damn, yeah, that's true, too. I guess that we have no choice. I Bye! I have to go, too. Let's go, in, let's go into the gym. Time to go! Monokumer. Hmm, asking us to gather together all of a sudden like this. What could he possibly want? It's not, nothing good. Being perfectly honest, nothing good. Indeed, yeah. what might await us this time? Hmm, <laughs> he keeps things interesting, that's for certain. How is that funny? Can't you smile like a normal person once in a while? Like, how's the housewife on a classic TV show smiles at the end of an episode? There's something totally messed up with you if you can laugh at a time like this. Which is, which of us is actually messed up, hmm? What's that supposed to mean? Nothing in particular, just admiring, that's all. 
I don't want to kill anyone, but I also don't want to stay here, living in blind denial like, day after day. I was just admiring how you could live like that and still keep your sanity. I'm not in what denial. This? That reminds me, remember how you kept talking about how the police or whoever would come to help us? How's that turn out? Seems there's no sign of whoever is po of whoever a possible rescue. Uh, yeah, that's been a... But that's been a thing. We've been in here at least a week. So, we've been in here, I think we've been in here a couple of days, more than a week now. So, yeah, the fact that nobody's come and shown up is uh, very interesting, indeed. That, that's just... I wonder what actually huh? happened. It's strange, that's Certainly. true. There's no way the police wouldn't want to know about it. We're right in the middle of a major urban area. The police suck! What? Fair point! On the contrary, the mastermind may be just that powerful to take control of even the police. Oh, that this might not be related, but then don't say it. <laughs> nope, gotta say it. Hmm. It's about last night. Not I was like near the main hall, just mystery. staring off into space. And all of a sudden, I heard it. You heard what? Huh? A sound that hmm. I don't really know what it was. What kind of sound? Well, like hmm. I said, I don't really know. But if I had to describe it, it was like a construction site, I guess? A construction site? I mean, I could have been making that up. I only just barely heard anything. And you definitely made it up. Well, it must have been just the sound of the ocean that in that head of yours. Say, what? What you talking about, Toko? Huh? And here comes Monokuma. Hi, bud. You little creepy bastard. He's arrived. Yeah. What Hero heard wasn't the sound of a construction. But it could have been an explosion. Huh? Or maybe a machine gun. <laughs> that, can, that can kind of sound like a construction in a way. What are you talking about? <laughs> Beyond this point, my mouth is zipped. My lips are sealed and I am fully puckered. That's a secret little secret. Fine, now let's move on to what you can tell us. Why did you call us here? You don't beat around the old bush, do you? Ready for me to get to the point, huh? But before that, if you mind, I, if I vent a little. I'm low on energy these days. My stitching even losing all its shine and luster. I'm thinking it's probably become the, become this whole hum boring old everyday life. I'm looking for someone, something with a little more stimulation, something rife with danger and intrigue. Listen, can I just yep. be frank? The next blackhead hasn't shown hey. up now, and I'm bo getting bored. So I've decided to come hey. up with a new way to motivate you. M motivate? Yeah, motivation is never good in his case. Is there another set of videos or something? Are you gonna show us something demented and try to drive us all to murder? Drive you to murder? What I mean? What a mean thing to say. Just awful. I don't know what you're you planning to do, but we're not going to kill each other over anymore. No matter what you do, I swear to God we won't. That's a very big talk. Do your very best to back it up, okay? Now then, with your permission, let me begin. So this time it's... Embarrassing memories and secrets. As long as you're alive, there's given. it's a given that there's some things that you don't want other people to know about you. So I did a little investigating on my own, and I dug up some of your darkest secrets. All right. And those embarrassing memories and secrets are all contained in the envelopes I have right mm. here. I'm going to hand them out now. So take a second to all take right. a peek. As Monica spoke, he tossed the envelopes at her feet. I quickly snatched the envelope with my name written on it. I nervously pulled out what was written inside. And my entire body suddenly went rigid. Makoto wet the bed until he was in fifth grade. What? H how? How'd you find out about this? Everyone started talking at once. Yeah, 24 hours if someone doesn't become blackened by then. Our deepest, darkest, most embarrassing of secrets will be exposed to the world. Maybe I'll roll by a crowded intersection in a van strapped with odd speech and spill the beans. Yeah, wouldn't that be so embarrassing? So that's what you meant by motivate. Yep, you got it. They're all pretty unpleasant. Trust me, none of you want me to reveal that stuff, right? It's definitely something that pe I'd rather people not know, but... We never kill over something like that. What did you say? He's right, your plan is doomed to fail. No one's ever going to murder someone for this kind of thing. 
Oh, oh no. Is it because, for better or for worse, your memory is still a way to connect with the outside world? I have stuff I wouldn't want anyone to know about no matter what, so I assumed you'd all be the same. Which is why I put so much effort into preparing this next motive. Man, you're saying you really won't kill each other over this stuff? That's just, that's just sex. Well, what can you do? Okay then, 24 hours, I'll expose all your secrets just to make myself feel a little better. So sad, so depressed, fair not well. With an almost a convincing look of depression of, de 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 of depressed dejection on his face, Malcolm will proceed into the gym's depths. I didn't know what to expect at first, but maybe we just dodged a bullet on this one. I mean, yeah, having those secrets revealed is going to be totally embarrassing. But that's seriously not going to give someone a reason to kill, right? Good news, everyone, I have a brilliant idea. Why don't we all just all confess the secrets in those envelopes right here and now? If we do that, any and all motive for murder will vanish. That's pretty smart, right? Okay, so my embarrassing I thing is... I, I don't want to hear your stupid story. <laughs> what? Besides, I don't I don't want to talk about it. I don't care what anyone says. I don't want to talk about mine. Neither do I. Not because it is unpleasant, but because it is impossible. Well, it's just a human nature to want to hear it when you, when you say it's impossible. Come on, it'll be good for you. Absolutely not. It's okay, just a little bit. Come on, come on, come on. As I said. Honestly. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I said I don't want to talk to you, human bag of lard. Yeah, he kind of well, he kind of deserves that a little bit. I agree with them. There's nothing, no need to discuss it. What do you think, Chihiro? I'm sorry, I don't really want to talk about it right now. But I also don't want to leave things out as they are, so maybe I can talk about it later. After I try my best to become strong, then I can tell everyone. If you don't want to talk, then you don't have to. I'm not super excited to talk about it either. If everyone's that much, that much against it, even if my little bro's, even if my bro's the one that suggested I gotta say no. Well, uh, okay, that's okay then. Either way, it was just if, it, if it's just a few secrets, I'm sure nobody's about to kill anybody over it. I hope you're right. A secret so bad you'd kill someone to keep it. Nobody's gonna get some, gonna get, got something like that, right? Okay, I'll stop with all the secret talk, but each of us has 24 hours to get ready. Having our secrets exposed isn't going to be fun, but it's not like we're going to die because of it. So, you know, uh, don't do anything hasty. The way you keep repeating it kind of makes me worry even more. Uh, okay, sorry, I know it's going to be tough, but... Uh, bing dong, bing pong, and now it's nighttime. He's gotten back to his office. Alright. Time for the end of this. <clears throat> this is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. As such, it is officially Yeah, I, I also don't think anybody should worry about it either way, because it's going to be 10 at 10 p.m. by the time it goes out and starts spilling the beans. So uh, I think a lot of people are either going to be going to be asleep or not care. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked, and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. Okay then, sweet dreams everyone. Good night, sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Yeah. Alright. Well, 24 hours starts now. Hmm. Nighttime already, huh? Okay, now let's call it a day. Good idea. We need to prepare for, for tomorrow. I was left with an anxiety. It just couldn't shake, but... We just left things as they were and left things as they lay. One by one, we head back to our rooms. Secrets of memories you don't want anyone to know about. A way to connect to the outside world. Honestly, all that crap Monokuma was spelling didn't have any effect on me. I mean, you just, you just went to bed. There's nothing, there's nothing really any, any problem. There's no way anyone would kill over that kind of stuff. At least that's what I thought. But maybe I was just being optimistic. Which is probably why, without too much of a struggle. Jeez, I'm more tired than usual. Super tired today. I fell asleep. But what I didn't know is that even then, a strategy was taking place. Marakuba Theater! Hey, do you have a second? I want to confide in you. It's about prevailing world attitude right now. The difference between passive and active, I mean. For example, it's the difference between like, oops, I killed them, and yeah, that's right, I killed them. Amazingly, there are tons of people who don't understand the difference. Can you believe it? 
but there's a huge difference between oops and that's right. You know what I'm saying, right? Anyone can kill someone in the heat of a moment, but surprising a thief can do it with calculated intent. To make that choice, then put it into action, it's way harder than, ju than just letting your emotions lead you. It's all about preparation, resolve. So maybe you're wondering, what's the point of I'm trying to make? Well, I'm not totally sure myself. Maybe you should try reading between the lines. Yeah, I think that's what what's going to come up with the next uh, big thing that is going to happen. Morning. Good. Good morning. Good morning. Why are you in my room? Ah! <laughs> nice reaction. I'm glad I didn't. I get. I get. Glad to see you didn't disappoint. What? What? What are you doing here? I wanted to spice yeah. things up, so instead of a school announcement, I decided to wake you up in person. What the hell for? Because it's fun. And as long as I'm here, I figured I'd let you hear it right from the bear's mouth. Hear what? Are you sure you should be acting this laid back? I mean, even though something happened to one of your buddy buddy classmates. What? Wah, 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 wah. Your face is all blue like someone on the verge of death. But what happened? What are you talking about? Boohoo! That's for me to know and for you to find out. Good luck! Something's happened to someone. Is it. Was it. No, it can't be. There's no way someone would. But what if? No, what ifs are pointless, especially now when. The dining hall. I need to go to the dining hall. Alright. Avocado! Ah, are you okay? Um, Makoma was in my room, but other than that, did Makoma talk to you too? Heroes, Hina, Sakura, and Togami. Yakua. You're the only ones here? Where's everyone else? Either they're already off trying to verify what Makoma said, or they've fallen victim to something that Makoma mentioned. The something? It can be. Perhaps. Has it happened again? Murder? After hearing what Makoma had to say, the worst possibility first swing to my head. It took everything I had to drive that thought away. So, oh, something really did happen. Does that mean someone did it because of what happened yesterday? It can't be. The stuff was just a bunch of old memories. Just old memories? Don't be so sure about that. Clearly, someone felt it was more important than that. Huh? To judge someone else's values based on your own outlook. Do you realize how dangerous that is? What? What did you even say? Why didn't you even... Why didn't you say something yesterday? Did you already forget? Sure this we. isn't a co-op game. It's every man for himself. What good does it do for me to go on my way to help you? Just stop saying that already. There's something wrong with him for serious. Did he get brainwashed or something? That's not important. What matters right now is we find out what happened. She's right. Let's go all split up and begin looking. Mm-hmm. The game is afoot. And... I think I'm gonna leave the episode here. So this is about where we were last time. I think we're going to leave the episode here, and uh, we're going to investigate the moiter next time. But, uh, yeah, that's so... I, I, I'm, sadly, I had to re-record a couple of... Re record this episode. Uh, unfortunate, but that's how it happens sometimes. Um, but uh, the good news is, this is the this is a visual novel type situation where I can just go back and re-roll out a previous save. So, yeah, that worked out for me in the long term, I think. But, uh, in any case... Yeah, I think I'm going to leave this episode here and we're going to be back on track with recording this for next time. So, uh, for now, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to follow me on Twitter in the description below. Um, be sure to check out my Patreon in the description below as well. It's only a couple bucks a month. It does really help me out. And you guys get access to a bunch of cool perks that are my way saying thanks. So, be sure to check those out. Link is down in the description. And finally, if you want to see more content from me, then be sure to check out the videos linked in the end screen. The top video is the most recent one. It may or may not be this one. Whereas the bomb video is the video recommended to you based on what you've already seen from me. So if you want to try something new or see more of what you like, then be sure to check both those videos out. And also be sure to check out my Twitch as well. I stream every Sunday. So if you want to see those, by all means, go follow me over on Twitch. But in any case, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.